All right, Greg, good morning to you and welcome to Sports on Newsdex. I'm George Ada Jr. We start with continental action here in Africa. We'll talk about Europe in a bit. The European Champions League is also up. Midyama SC can reach the CAF Confederations Cup semi-finals today by grabbing just a point to finish second in Group A. Now the Taco Bay side, uh, you know, apt to play Emo Bajaya in Algeria and can only go through with a win or any form of a draw. Midyama moves three points about Bajaya with a thrilling 3-2 victory over group leader Stipe Mazembe. Now on the side, Moses Parker says they are highly motivated to get a good result and also ensure a historic semi-final bet. The approach is highly, highly, highly. The boys are well motivated. As I'm telling, I'm speaking to you now. I think with the board, board chairman and uh, the team, uh, the management, we've done our part. So we, we can't afford to lose this match. We need to qualify. And I know I'm going with the team. Whatever it takes to motivate them also and we shall do it for us to get a point uh, or seek the qualification to the semi-finals so we wish Vidyama Essi good luck in that game. Updates of that will be on, you know, at midday. And of course, whilst the game is ongoing, join Sports Today at 2 p.m. Do join us for that. But now we can talk about continental action elsewhere. And the UEFA Champions League playoff stages are in. Manchester United will be, uh, Manchester City will be looking to qualify once and for all after a fantastic start against Star Bucharest, which has Suleiman Tari's brother, Suleiman Niu. Now, though, let's talk about the other tie everybody's looking forward to. It's Roma up against Porto tonight. Here's a preview to it. 